I'm Veronique Masterson, and here's what you need to know about what's happening at the University of Texas at El Paso. NASA's chief technologist, Dr. Mason Peck, was on campus for the official opening of the College of Engineering Center for Space Exploration Technology Research, as well as the NASA Science Engineering, Mathematics, and Aerospace Education Lab. The NASA-funded center conducts analytical, experimental, and computational research in energy and propulsion engineering. The center has enabled UTEP to train the workforce of the future that NASA is looking for. Peck also kicked off UTEP's Centennial Lecture Series, speaking with students and the community. The University of Texas System's Lewis Stokes Alliance for Minority Participation, or UTL SAMP program, has received $4 million from the National Science Foundation. The program, based at UTEP, seeks to increase the number of minority students pursuing careers in science, technology, engineering, and mathematics in Texas. The university wants the community to be prepared for election season and engage young voters in the electoral process. The two-month-long UTEP Picks kicked off with the Roger and Evelyn Bell Political Buttons exhibit at the UTEP Library. The collection is made up of buttons that date from the 1880s to the present. Dr. Greg Rocha, Associate Professor of Political Science, spoke about the role campaign buttons played in early political communication. UTEP and New Mexico State University are working together to help save lives. The two universities will collect blood donations from students, staff, faculty, alumni, and the community in the week-long I-10 Coalition Blood Drive beginning Monday, September 10th. Blood donation sites will be set up on campus from 8 a.m. to 3 p.m. each day of the drive. United Blood Services will announce the total number of pints collected at the Battle of I-10, UTEP versus NMSU football game, Saturday, September 15th in the Sun Bowl. Two exhibits are set to open at the Stanley and Gerald Rubin Center for the Visual Arts. Shifting Sands, recent videos from the Middle East, features an international selection of artists who use film and video to explore the Middle Eastern desert as a state charged with meaning. SEFT1 is a transdisciplinary project. The artists designed a futuristic vehicle equipped to move on both land and rail. Both exhibits will be presented in conjunction with the Desert Initiative and with the annual meeting of the International Society for Electronic Arts. UTEP, via the Rubin Center, is the only venue in Texas invited to participate in either of these initiatives. Don't forget your dancing shoes this weekend. Three of the most celebrated ambassadors of Latin music will electrify music lovers at the Don Haskins Center this Sunday. Gigantes features Mark Anthony, Marco Antonio Solis, and Cheyenne. For more information about these stories and others, make sure to visit utepnews.com. I'm Veronique Masterson. Go Miners! Thank you.